Hello and welcome back to another video. This problem, we're asked which of the following is the sum of the two polynomials shown above. So we have these right here. So when we're adding them, we can add them by doing an expression where you do the first one plus the second one and do it like that. But when you have them lined up like this, where we have the x squared term and the x squared term, an x term and an x term, a constant and a constant, I think it's easier to add them up like you would do normal addition, where we add them like this, and you can say two minus six, that's negative four. Negative five minus two is negative seven, and then you just have to remember the x, and then three plus five is eight, and you just have to remember that you're adding x squared. So we're adding like terms here, so we just have to add their coefficients, right? So you have three of x squared and five of it, that means you in total you have three plus five of it. And when you line them up like this, it's a lot easier to do the addition to make sure you counted all your terms and you get your final answer is eight x squared minus seven x minus four, which correlates with answer A. As always, thank you for liking and subscribing. I'll see you in the next video.